been keeping a real big secret here. I've been chomping at the bit to tell y'all. Boom, baby. Here it is. Oh, man, it's my turn. We've got for the very first time anywhere in the world a baby leucistic alligator. First one born anywhere in the world right here at Gatorland. So let us give you a little background on leucistic and albino alligators to tell you the difference and why leucistics are so rare. So Mike, pay attention to me here, okay? You. I'm listening. So albinos have pink eyes. Yep. There's hundreds of albino alligators around the world, but leucistics have little patches of normal coloration on them and these crystal blue eyes. That's what makes them a leucistic. There was 18 of them born in a nest in Louisiana back in 1987. There's only seven of them still living today. Three of them are right here at Gatorland. That's, awesome. That's how That's rare awesome. they are, there's only yep. seven. So we are so excited that we've got a baby from one of them. Woo! Woo! I've been waiting to tell y'all this forever. We've been uh, trying to get her to sit on this forever. I'm not good at keeping secrets. So back in 1996, I got a call from the Audubon Zoo in New Orleans. They said they had an outdoor pool that they wanted a big normal colored alligator for it. Yep. So they called us up and said, hey man, can you get us a, a normal colored alligator, a big beautiful one? And you answered, because boss answer. man used to talk in a funny voice, and he said, hey y'all, no. this is Gatorland. Hey y'all, it's me Mark Q, I'm CEO here at Gatorland. Well, howdy folks, and welcome to Gatorland, the alligator capital of the world. My voice wasn't that high. So 12 years later, we had a big fire burn down the whole front of our park. We're barely staying open. And uh, we're struggling, trying to get back. I get a call from the Audubon Zoo says, hey man, that big gator that you gave us got a spot on his foot. We had to take him, put him in a farm outside of New Orleans. That farm's going out of business with the recession. If you want him, you need to come get him. And by the way, they've got four big white alligators there with me if you want those too. Couldn't believe it. Yes! Oh yeah, man, no, man, no. We'll take those off your hands. Yeah, we'll come get them. So I told you guys, yeah. get in that truck. Go get those gators. Don't get lost this time. It Bring those it back. It take us as long. When we got those white alligators, they had two normal colored females uh -huh. They were supposed to carry the gene. They were right. the offspring for right. the first time. They really never know. had a yeah. white one born. But we really didn't know well, if we they did or sure, not. Yeah. We weren't sure. I got a text message from Danielle with a picture back in August that said, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, there's a nose sticking out of one of the leucistic eggs and it's white. What? Oh man, I got chill bumps and started crying because we have been trying to get these babies forever. Being that the mom carries the gene, she's normal color, and the daddy is solid white leucistic, that means that he has both recessive genes. That means that they're going to produce about 50% white ones, you would think, and 50% normal colored ones. Now once you start doing math, Yeah, this you is love, a science. So a 50% yeah, plus a 50% is it's 100%. 100. And so we got two babies hatched out. 50% were white, 50% were normal colored. It's the craziest, most exciting thing that's ever happened in the whole entire alligator and crocodile world. This gene has never been reproduced. We have it. It's so amazing. And it is the prettiest alligator I've ever seen in my whole entire life. I mean, look at this little baby. Look at this little baby walk along the ground. Right. But look at the dark eyes on that beautiful little baby I there. Oh, she's so cute. <laughs> Feisty, and just here's an good interesting thing too. It took them 10 extra days to hatch. Usually American alligators hatch about 65 days. These alligators hatched on the 75th day. Yeah, I we know, were, we were, we're about to give up. up. We were worried they're gonna, they're just not gonna hatch. But they did, and we have them, and nowhere else in the world has a baby leucistic alligator, except for the alligator capital of the world, Gatorland! Oh, baby! We brought our veterinarian in. We wanna check that baby out make sure she's in perfect health. Oh, and she was. We looked at her eyes, checked out inside her ears. This little white alligator and her normal colored little brother are just beautiful and feisty little critters. The really cool thing about leucistics, is, and you guys may not know this, I've tried to tell you a couple of times. What is it? Cajun folklore says good fortune comes to those lucky enough to stare into the crystal blue eyes of the white alligator. I've heard really? this Isn't that cool? I've heard this sign. I read yeah. it on the sign. Yeah, we made it up. We had this group of travel riders from England uh -huh. came in uh -huh. and we were all standing around and going and I went, hey, you guys know that Cajun folklore says good fortune comes to those lucky enough to stare <laughs> into the blue eyes of the white alligator. And every one of them went, 
whoop, right over right the glass. Right over there to the glass and start started staring. Started staring at those blue eyes. I don't remember that. I looked around at these guys and said, oh my gosh, that crap works, man. I want that on everything. So you guys need to come on out here to Gatorland and <laughs> stare if you dare. <laughs> come on out here to Gatorland in Orlando, Florida and stare if you dare. My voice is not that high. Man, that was as good as we could do on social media yeah. back 14 years ago. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Come on. We want y'all to help us name those white alligators. We got the little white sister and the little normal colored brother. We need names for those. Yes. So put it in the comments. Put it in the comments. YouTube. Instagram, YouTube, TikTok. Put it in the comments. We need Facebook. a great name for this brother yes. and sister. They're and it so can adorable. be salt and pepper, so stop right there if you're typing salt and pepper. That's Brian Bartek. Yeah, that's our yeah. friend Brian's got a salt and pepper for two alligators. We love you, Brian. Look at the leucistic alligators. They are the rarest alligator in the world. We've got Trezos and Pharos and their girlfriends there. Take a look at them. Look at the glass and stare if you dare. And subscribe. <laughs> and push that notification bell. <laughs>